Hi, and welcome to Cash Register Startup before the sale. Some pictures in this slideshow are intentionally blurred to protect the privacy of customers and business owners. Currency is blurred as well to avoid legal issues. Thank you for your understanding. A cash register calculates and records sales transactions. It includes a drawer for currency. A simple cash register might be used at a craft fair, a farmer's market, on a rolling cart in a mall, a restaurant where only taxable items are sold, and at many small retailers. This course covers first things first, turning on the cash register, installing the cash drawer, and entering your user ID. First let's talk about the cash register key. Many cash registers may come with a key. The key selects the cash register's current mode. The key also opens the cash drawer. In void mode, you would be canceling a transaction. Point the key to the void position to cancel a transaction in the cash register system. Off turns the power to the cash register off. Point the key to the off position to power down the cash register. Reg turns the cash register on. Point the key to the reg position to use the cash register. X runs a report used to balance the cash drawer at the end of a shift. This does not zero out the daily totals. Point the key to the X position to run an X report. Z runs a report which gives sales and hourly readings and clears out the day's totals. Point the key to the Z position to run a Z report. Lastly, P selects the programming mode. Point the key to the P position to program keys for tax rates and categories. Generally, look at the cash register's manual for more details on how to program various keys on the cash register. When you're ready to start using the cash register, Check to make sure that the register is in reg mode, as shown here. If the key is not in the lock, the lock itself should point towards the reg setting. The cash drawer. The cash drawer in the register stores transaction payments and change. You may have to unlock the cash drawer to access its contents. The cash register key often also unlocks the drawer. You may have to insert a new cash drawer. Just push this one in at an angle, then drop it into place. So, now you can make sure the cash register is ready for your personal use. You're going to enter your user ID on the numeric keypad. First of all, the number keys, or the numeric keypad, on the cash register are upside down from the number keys on your telephone. It's the same layout as an adding machine. Your personal user ID number will be given to you by your trainer or supervisor. There may be a special key such as CLRK pound that you press after entering in your code. Enter this user number in before you start ringing up transactions. Why? You should not be responsible for errors which occur prior to the time you logged in with your user number. You should not have to re-enter your user number while you are using the register. And you should not be responsible for errors which occur after you log out either. Keep in mind that these are all just general guide guidelines and directions. There are many different types of cash registers. It's impossible to cover them all here in this short course. Your trainer will tell you which keys on your specific cash register will complete specific transactions. For further information, many equipment manufacturers offer user manuals on their websites. Just get the make and model and search for the manufacturer's website. You may be the only employee with your own cash register manual. 
So that's it for cash register startup. To recap, the cash register may require a key to turn it on. The cash drawer may need to be either unlocked or installed. Entering your user ID specifies the time that you were on duty at the cash register. Now you can go to www.makingchange.mobi. Take a 10 question quiz on the cash register startup to show potential employers your depth of knowledge. Thanks for the help of Tramway Market, Kingsbury Grade, Stateline Nevada, and Bill Lowe. Please send comments, suggestions, or new topic ideas to info at makingchange.mobi. Thanks for viewing Cash Register Startup and best of luck to you out there.